this statement that you've written has been signed by uh, 16 Russian, Ukrainian, international uh, companies. Talks about how one of the greatest moments of our lives was the fall of the Berlin Wall uh, and the end of the Cold War. Yet you're very concerned that the conflict between Russia and Ukraine is showing we are going backwards, that that progress over the past 25 years, you didn't expect we'd be here 25 years after the fall of the Berlin, Berlin Wall. What can we do about it? Yeah, I think um, we all speak with one voice, and I, I must have spoken to over 100 Russian businessmen, over 100 Ukrainian businessmen, and um, and Western businessmen, and um, and every one of us are um, incredibly sad that uh, the dreams of what had happened when the Berlin Wall came down, uh, of Russian people uh, being able to trade, marry, um, uh, you know, go on holiday. Uh, with Western people, um, where, where we would effectively act as, uh, you know, one group of countries where we could be friends, we're working together to sort out uh, the bigger problems of the world, uh, seems to be diminishing rapidly. And, um, and what we're appealing to governments to do uh, is, you know, to try to rectify what's happened in the last 12 months, try to put the clock back to, what, to where we were 12 months ago as best as possible, um, and uh, and if if they need uh, business people to help, um, I mean Russian business people maybe to talk to President Putin, mm -hmm. uh, Ukrainian business people to talk to uh, President President Poroshenko, and, and and likewise, we're very happy to play a role in it. Is this letter meant for Vladimir Putin, the Russian president, to take heed that we're going in the wrong direction? Well, look, I I, I think that. Um, uh, that you know, Pre President Putin, uh, I think, needs to realize that uh, Russian business people and the, the, the people who signed this document, uh, you know, the biggest car manufacturer in Russia, the biggest dairy producers um, in, in Russia, uh, the biggest supermarket chain, they're all self-made people um, who are, ve are very saddened and very worried about the way things are going. And, 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 um, and you know, a, a compromise needs to be reached. In, in business, you reach compromises. But the, the last thing that is needed is military intervention. Um, you know, that should be a thing of the past. And uh, further military intervention will, will result in, uh, in decades, I think, of Russia being ostracized. It means that Europe won't buy its fuel from Russia. Um, it, 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 you know, it means the people of Russia will suffer. And, and, um, and that's not, that's not the answer. Have you met Vladimir Putin before? I've met him briefly, but I, I, I don't know him. Um, I don't know him well. Um, I've met. I've met. I know his prime minister better. Um, and um, you know, and I would be delighted to sit down with him. I'd be de delighted to meet him. I'd be delighted to, you know, see whether you, um, you know issues can be bridged because um, they, they've got to be bridged one day. And you know, today is better than waiting till tomorrow. And their economy is stalled and falling backward. Yes, I mean the the Russian economy is 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 going to go in a steep decline. It'll go back to the days of uh, pre Cold War unless uh, this problem is resolved quickly. And um, and it's just too sad. I mean, I, I've got a lot of Russian friends. We go on holidays together. Um, we trade together. Um, we party together. Um, and you know there there are much bigger problems in this world that we should be addressing. I mean, the, you know, the horrors that are taking place in Iraq. Um, you know, the, 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 there, are, there are plenty of problems around the world. Um, we, we, it's important that, you know, as soon as possible, Russia becomes more integrated into Europe, um, feels that they can trust Europe and Europe can trust them. Um, and, you know, we, 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 we um, you know, we, 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 we've become friends again, which is which was what most Russian people um, want to see happen.